Hey everybody, Zach here. Welcome back to the channel, and it's time for the first sip. Oh, that is amazing. So welcome back to the channel. If it's your first time dropping in, uh, we do love coffee here on the channel too. And um, if you've been here before, thank you so much for stopping by again. And here we go. The market, the crypto market, is coming back. Uh, and here we can see right now 2.11 trillion dollar global market cap up 3.17 percent the top three trending tokens phantom uh, kala and solana solana is over 200 dollars this morning i said it could top out at 250 i'm just i'm just going to quit putting price predictions on solana at this point because it is insane uh, what sol is doing right now so before we get into the overall crypto market what is going on we're going to take a look at the crypto fear and greed index Take a look at the hottest news right now going on in the crypto space, as well as uh, we're going to take a look at um, the top 100 here, see the biggest movers, and uh, get you all filled in and updated on where the market is heading here on a Thursday morning, afternoon, or evening for you, wherever you are around the world. So real quick, before we jump into it, we do have our Patreon page. This link is down in the description. We've got two levels over here. $10 level is going to get you access to our Discord uh, this is a per month basis here. $20 per month, uh, going to get you Discord access as well as uh, guidance and help with your portfolio. That means you can send me screenshots, send me your portfolio in a link. I'll look at it, give you my feedback whenever you want. Uh, hot weekly crypto alerts. I'll give you those once, uh, once, twice, sometimes three times a week. Buy and sell trade alerts as well. Every time I buy, every time I sell, you will know as well as a portfolio that I put together. I'll give you a link to that. You can see what a winning portfolio looks like. This portfolio was built just for the insiders. So all of that, and then the big thing is included in both these packages, access to brilliant people in our private community who know a bunch of things about crypto. I've learned a ton, and uh, you can too with that link down in the description. All right, so let's bounce back over to coin market cap. So here we go. Bitcoin is coming back today, uh, but here comes Ethereum. It's up 2.4%. Look at Cardano, now up 10%. Things are moving in the right direction. Solana has surpassed XRP in market cap. It is number six on the big board at $15 billion market cap. I'm sorry, $60 billion market cap. This number right here. Wow. And it wouldn't be much until it takes over Tether and Binance to become number four here on the big board this is absolutely astonishing i mean what solana has done here dogecoin is up a hair here three and a half percent as well as xrp chain link coming back here here comes terra luna algorand has had a really good run the last couple days same thing here with avalanche uh, ftx token everything's starting to turn green here here comes polygon here comes v chain coming back theta uh, what else do we got? Near protocols up big. Phantom up really big again, up 34%. You know, a lot of people got in on Phantom. Elrun is up 34%. Okay, Waves, H bar. Look at H bar is up 24%. That's a good. Uh, that's a good move there. Here's Shiba Inu. It's up 18%. So everything coming back green here. This is great to see. So the market is looking like it's turning a corner. Let's go over to the Crypto Fear and Greed Index here because this tells the story uh, oftentimes here. The Fear and Greed Index right now is at 45, which is fear, which is good for buyers. Okay, so what I'm, what I'm thinking we're going to continue to see throughout the day is um, buyers. We're going to see people rushing back into the crypto markets. I would say by this weekend, late this weekend, early next week, we'll be right back to where we were before this little flash crash. Uh, in my opinion, I think this was certainly just market manipulation. Um, I think a bunch of people said, oh, it's Bitcoin Day in El Salvador. Let's just sell off, right, and um, buy back in at cheaper prices. Retail investors were buying back in. Institutional money was coming back in. So, you know, this kind of hints at something that's going on, too, right? We talk about are we going to go through these prolonged periods of crypto droughts, right, or crypto winters. Uh, I just don't know anymore because there's so much money wrapped up in Bitcoin, in DeFi, in all these altcoins. Are we going to go through these big downturns in the market like we had in the past? Let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section about that and or any asset you're really excited about right now. 
Love to hear from you always down there. Okay, so let's bounce into the crypto news aggregator and see the top stories right now around the crypto space. Ethereum charges back to 3,537 as top 10 largest wallets skyrocket in ETH supply. So the top 10 wallets uh, are adding on to their positions. They are buying the dip, if you will. Tuesday's flash crash caught Bitcoin investors off guard, but the writing was on the wall. Uh, maybe they're going to speak to the crypto fear and greed index here, but let's see what they say. Uh, following Bitcoin's flash crash, which took the rest of the market down as well, investors are wondering what happened. The CEO of uh, Alamedia Research, Sam Trabuco, commented that it was the most significant move in months. While it also caught him off guard, a further look at the signs show a dip was on the cards. What are the signs he's referring to? Um, let's see here. From the peak, let's lead in cryptocurrency. Let's see. Boom, boom, boom. What happened? Okay. They say that those who do not learn from history are doomed to repeat it. Who remembers what earlier this year? Uh, when crypto rallied a ton to 65K pretty quickly, futures were at a high premium and open interest of all important contracts. And we got to pull back from that time, right? Okay, so basically just saying, hey, it was it was due for a correction. We know that. I mean, we could we could see that on the fear and greed index. Things were moving up at rapid paces. So we kind of knew, you know, that 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 a some type of correction slash flash crash was in order, right? Any swap enters into a strategic partnership with Harmony. Harmony one, interesting. Okay. Binance person to person will delist five DAI trading pairs. Interesting there. Okay. I used the die coin there. Cardano native DeFi Adelend raises 540k in seed funding. Solana tops 200 as Google search data shows peak retail interest. Wow, how about that? Solana tops 200. That came out 58 minutes ago. Okay, uh, a couple other things. NFTs appear in Times Square. NFTs continuing to skyrocket. It is just absolutely insane. A um, board yacht club. Board Ape Yacht Club uh, NFT just recently sold for $2.2 million. Crazy. Crazy, crazy, crazy. Now, this article saying, will Solana rocket to 400 soon? I mean, it's just wild what DeFi uh, is doing right now. It is absolutely off the charts. All right, so um, hopefully you got some value out of this video. Real quick, let's take a look at a couple um, assets here on the on the charts, and uh, instead of the one minute, let's go down to the one hour here. We can get an idea. So we saw Shiba Inu on the heels of the big news yesterday run up. It has since kind of just consolidated here. Uh, it's right below the 07 level right now, and uh, we can see here. Here's Cardano's chart this morning. Cardano's making some nice gains here back from yesterday, so it's looking to work back up. The same thing here with Ethereum, slowly but surely working its way back up. Bitcoin. So every asset kind of either consolidating right now or slowly working their way back up. Here's VeChain. There's the uptrend there for VeChain. Uh, here's Solana. I mean, this is wild. How about this for Solana? We dipped down to 153 and then just exploded back up. Uh, wow, just crazy stuff here um, on Sol and uh, continues to move higher here. Uh, congratulations to everybody who got in this early, who's holding this still. Uh, you are making a killing and... I'm happy for you. I'm, I'm seriously happy for you. I love to see people make money in this space. All right, down below in the comment section, uh, you'll also see the link for the Patreon. Don't forget about that one. Thank you so much for stopping by, and we'll continue to watch the markets. And uh, take care, and I'll see you in the next one.